Annie? So we've had our sauna about a month. We love it. We use it every night. Um, we turn it on before we put the kids to bed and then it's nice and hot when they fall asleep finally. We jump in here together. Right now it's 123 degrees, feeling awesome, a little bit sweaty, not uncomfortable. Um, and the reason we bought the sauna was because of all the health benefits. Not only is it super relaxing and your muscles feel amazing afterwards, it calms your brain, but there's some real science behind why saunas are so good for you. There's a Finnish study that went, came out a couple years ago talking about increased sauna usage, um, lowers all-cause mortality, it's good for muscle growth, it's good for brain health, cardiovascular health. I mean, it's just across the board awesome for you. I think it lowers insulin, lowers blood pressure, um, and these are like real science findings. It's not made up. Um, it's from scientific journals and stuff like that. So Right. We, we listen to a lot of health podcasts. So uh, Ben Greenfield, uh, Dr. D'Agostino, uh, Dr. Rhonda Patrick, uh, and they all echo the same thing that activating heat shock proteins, uh, getting in the sauna, getting hot, leads to so many uh, just benefits in the human body. So that's what we're starting to realize now. Um, and we're excited to see how that continues in the future. All right, welcome back to the sauna. It's a toasty 128 degrees and rising. Uh, we've got 40 minutes on the clock and we wanted a couple minutes just to talk about why we purchased the sauna and the effects that we've received since we've been using it. So we've been using it for about a month. And what do you think? We like it. Our, um, we kind of use it at night, every night. We turn it on before we put the kids to bed and it preheats by the time they're asleep. We jump in here together. It's nice quiet time. We leave our electronics out. And we either talk or we meditate or sometimes listen to a podcast. And it's nice to gather time without um, technology. And it's kind of good to reconnect away from screens and cell phones and all that. Yeah, we, I have a sauna at a gym at work, a traditional sauna. And I'd never used the infrared one. And so it was a little bit different getting used to this, um, but in a good way. So the traditional sauna is just so hot. I could only hack it for about 10, 15 minutes before I just got so uncomfortable. Um, I tried to meditate, but breathing through my nostrils would burn. It was just really, really tough to do. But here in the infrared sauna, it's much different. It's a cooler temperature, but still so hot that, I mean, I'm sweating bullets. It's crazy how much sweat really comes out. Um, but yes. And I have no sauna experience, but I'm, I'm a believer now. I love it. This is the best. It totally calms us down. My brain kind of disengages and relaxes my muscles feel amazing it feels like I just got a massage it totally gets me ready for bed and just calms everything down 